Not actually too bad, all things considered. Uh -huh. So, it's a uh, first cast. Uh, had a small pollock, sorry, at the first cast. But now I've had these two boys. Two nice doggies. Uh -huh. The joys of fishing Fina Pier at night. It's got a good few of them. No ray yet, but sorry, it's early, it's early. Right, guys, I had just shown you how I'm baiting up here tonight on Phoenix. Uh, take a, a lovely large eel. Some guys will say this is a uh, sacrilege now, but uh, I like to take the top and the, the bottom off. I cut them in half. I'm not using too big a hook. I'm on the hunt for rays tonight, so hopefully, I've retrieved a bit elastic. Hopefully, I'm going to pick up one. Uh, so far, a few dogs. And a, a double shot of dogs there as well. So, just very simply, you might be able to see that orange colour coming out of that there. That's the row. You always get them this time of year. You don't get too many people uh, with eels like that. That generally don't share. But, I'm going to whip them on nice and handy. Is it? See that lovely row there? So that's one hook. Fly into the face. Two hooks. I wasn't going to bother with a video tonight, but sure look, a bit of fun. What else would you be doing on a Monday night? The uh, the joys of shift work. So. Get that on there. Rose escaping that one, so. Whip it onto the side. So, hopefully get a ray tonight, but if not, we'll get something. A bit of crack. So we're flying it with the old species hunt aspect of tonight. Um, probably smaller hooks as well, just to try and get a shore rock, because I don't have one of those. And the rod starts hopping out of the stand. Nice little pollock. Again, you can see it's a pollock because of the lower lip being bigger and the line on his side having that curve so double shot at him thought the second one was a pot was a uh, a shore rockling but uh no look little strips of mackerel is all i'm using really thought i had an old shore rockling there but wasn't to be early yet plenty of fish around so i'm gonna keep fishing for another while and uh lovely mild night so I'm gonna keep going hopefully a rail show up tides just turned so it's nearly home time and if I was inside in the shot nearly home time especially when you see your whole sand deal being taken by little poor cod you can tell they're poor cod because all their scales come off in your hand disappointing when these guys are around and there's nothing eating them that's a bad job. So, I'm going to pack it up quite soon. Uh, I've had a good old night. I'd say seven or eight dogs, seven or eight pollock as well to go with him and that old poor cod. Uh, no shore rockling like I'd hoped, but not too bad. And I think the light or the new light system is kind of working nicely, considering it's, it's, it's obviously pitch dark in Phoenix. So, I'll show you without it, this is what we'd be looking like. So, it's not going too badly. Put it back up on my little uh, makeshift thing. Don't think it'll survive the wind, but sure, what can you do? So, a couple more casts, I'm gonna wrap it up then, I think. So, I'm not sure if you'd class it as a successful night or an unsuccessful. Uh, no rays or shore rockling like I had hoped, but plenty of dogs and pollock and even the poor cod. All in all, just a bit of fun. So, I said I'd record and get back into the swing of things with the videos. Thanks for watching.